An Amazon Prime cake, that is what we are creating today. I wasn't sure that this was gonna be a tutorial because it's so easy to make. There's no carving at all, which is why I love it. Hi everyone, my name is Eva Longoria. Let's get started. Hey. Now I made this cake primarily for Instagram and for Mighty Mix, but after I created it, I was so excited. It is so simple. I didn't really do much. <laughs> I get Amazon packages a lot, so I thought it'd be pretty cool to make a cake of. I always order kitty litter for Amazon because it's like 50 pound boxes and I don't wanna have to lug it up my stairs. So the UPS guy does it. <laughs> now for this cake, I'm using two 13 by, f uh, this big, <laughs> eight by 11 inch cakes. I just cut away all of the caramelization on the sides. I left a little bit on the top and the bottom. I know, I mean, you could take that away too, but you're cutting more cake. Now in goes some buttercream, like always. This is just sweet cream buttercream. I always forget to add vanilla, which is kind of why I like to add sprinkles. It just makes it a little bit more special. You know, you forget something, so you make up for it with something else. And I just smear it into the middle of my cake. So I can just mix it into the buttercream a little bit. Now on goes my second layer of cake. Look at that. Corners are perfect. There isn't carving at all besides cutting out the caramelization. And you can skip that if you want. Now this baby is just gonna get a crumb coat covering the entire thing with buttercream. Um, the buttercream that I'm using is actually store-bought because I was too lazy to make my own. <laughs> I'm just cutting corners <laughs> everywhere on this cake, you guys. Now, I placed my cake in the fridge to set, especially because this was store-bought buttercream. I took it out and I covered it with the most luxurious, oh wow, it's, this color is so brilliant. I'm calling it cardboard box color. I literally just took Amazon boxes, just put it next to my fondant and tried to like replicate the color. For cake purposes, I made it just a little bit more bright because cardboard brown is a disgusting color. <laughs> this isn't perfect, but I want it to be a little bit more pretty. Now I'm pinching the edges of my cake with my fingers and I'm just using two fondant smoothers to like pinch the corners off as well. Look at that. That way I get really sharp corners. Then I just use my fondant smoother to create some very defined edges. I want them to be really sharp. Now the thing that I like about YouTube videos is I can tell you things that you're not gonna know if you just saw this video on Instagram. I got too cocky when covering this cake with fondant and the piece of fondant that I used wasn't big enough to cover all of the back and the right side of the cake. But I knew that I was doing this directly on my like tabletop. I wasn't gonna be spinning the cake so you can't see my mistake at all. But I'm sharing it with you because I want to make sure that if you try to do this, make sure you measure your fondant so that it covers the entire cake and not just the side of the cake that the camera sees. There you go. Nobody, nobody on Instagram or on Mighty Mix will ever know that information. And I wanted this to feel like a box. So I'm actually cutting into the middle of my cake and so that when I add my edible prime tape, it'll fall into that crack so it looks more real. Now, one small Amazon smile detail on the side, that's it. And then I'm gonna cut a little bit onto the side to make it look more like an actual box. Then I am adding my Amazon Prime edible tape. I went to the Baker's Bodega in Pico Rivera, that's where I always go for stuff. I created the Amazon Prime tape. I went there and they printed it out for me. It was so easy, I didn't have to do anything. It doesn't go all the way down, but to make this look more realistic, I added a small piece of tape to the bottom so it looks like that the bottom of this is wrapped as well. Now if you've watched me on Quali Pops before, then you know that I love The Office. I've seen every season at least five times. I think last month I finished my fifth time and then after New Year's I'll probably start it again. <laughs> Even in the intro of my videos when I'm saying my name, I've been 
almost every character in the office. So Stanley Hudson, Michael Scott, Dwight Schrute, Pam Halpert, Jim Halpert, Phyllis Vance, uh, Angela, the Christian, <laughs> I don't know her name. When I decided to create postage for this box, I went with the Dunder Mifflin postage code. Same thing, it's edible paper, I'm just placing it on top. Dunder Mifflin Paper Company. And that's the address of the Scranton branch. And my favorite part of this is that it says assistant to the regional manager, Dwight K. Schrute III. I love The Office, I, I just think it's so funny. And so I try to incorporate it as often as I can. Now after that, my Amazon Prime cake was complete. I order way too much from Amazon, but it's so cheap. And I know it's putting a lot of department stores out of business, but you know, when you're trying to save a buck and you don't want to lift your kitty litter all the way up the stairs, you can have somebody else do it for you. I am really curious about this. Do you use Amazon Prime and what do you order the most? Now, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you're having a happy holiday. I love you. I will see you very soon. Peace.